what is up here it's Pyric and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to connect a PS3 controller to your PC so you only need three things to begin with um, you'll need the mini USB cable that either came with your PS3 controller or um, you just have one laying around that works too um, you'll need the DualShock 3 controller only DualShock um, generic controllers or other brand or whatever they don't work and um, a computer obviously so the first thing you want to do is actually not mess with any of this stuff you don't need, even need to connect it right now what you'll need to do is go to recovery options and uh, do restart so for this I'm gonna need to switch over to my camera alright so we're back to my camera um, Alright, so you're going to want to go to Troubleshoot um, and Advanced Options. And then you'll want to go to Startup Settings. And s see all these here? You're going to want to disable Driver Signature Enforcement. You're going to want to do that. So, Restart. And you'll be greeted with a screen that um, will have all the options. And then you'll use the function keys to uh, select this option. So here you want to click F7 which will disable driver signature enforcement which allows you to install the DualShock 3 drivers um, which typically would only be compatible with uh, Linux which is well a form of Linux that kind that the PS3 uses um, or pre Windows 10 and if it's if you have window uh, operating system before Windows 10 you don't need to do this but it was introduced with Windows 10 it's kind of stupid but whatever alright so now that we've disabled that we can uh, install two other things well actually first you'll need to plug in your PS3 controller and the driver should install automatically. So after the drivers install, you'll want to install Motion Enjoy and Better DS3. Um, so after you have everything hooked up, you can open Motion Enjoy. So here it is. Here's the user interfa interface. Um, so assuming it's connected, which mine already is, but um, you want to go to Driver Manager, and um, should have these options right here so this is your driver and well, actually it's your PS3 controller and you'll check this and then install and it should load and you go back and your PS3 controller should now show up right here with the charging status right here um, so It'll say, it'll give you these options right here, and you'll want to um, click on this one right here. And you can change the motor sensitivity and that stuff, but that doesn't really matter right now. So you can close that once you've done all that. So now you'll want to open Better DS3. And again, mine's already connected, but. Um, you want to create a new profile right here. Um, there. We'll do, you do X input, and now um, you can do autofill for Xbox 360, and it should fill in all the settings that you need. I changed that. But, um, and if something's wrong, when you go to test out the game, then you can go back here and tweak things so that it works all completely good. Um, mine did that but it's a pretty easy fix. So you'll want to select your new profile and click apply. So this will allow you to play pretty much any game that is on a console with a controller. Uh, thanks for watching guys and Subscribe for more stuff like this.